Hi friends, welcome to AB MBBS. Today's topic is measles. First up, measles is caused by paramyxovirus, which is a RNA virus. Next, what is the incubation period of measles? It is 10 to 14 days. Now, if you consider this to be the timeline and this as the point of exposure on day 0, then fever occurs on day 10 and rash occurs on day 14. But remember, the incubation period of vaccine induced measles is only 7 days. Next, the source of measles infection is from cases. There is no carrier in measles and there is no animal reservoir too. The mode of transmission of measles is by air droplets. The period of communicability of measles is from 4 days before to 4 days after the appearance of rash. The secondary attack rate of measles is 80%. Measles also shows seasonal trend every 2 to 3 years and it mainly occurs in the period of January to April that is in early spring. The clinical features of measles is divided into three stages. The first stage which is the prodromal stage causes fever, coryza and nasal discharge. In the eruptive stage, dusky red colored maculopapular rash occurs like this. Mind you, the rash begins from behind the ear that is it has retroauricular origin. In this stage, coplic spots also occur like this, this one and this one. It has, it is the characteristic sign of measles. It occurs in the buccal mucosa opposite the second molar tooth. Finally, there is the post measles stage which is characterized by weight loss and diarrhea. Next, the complications of measles. Otitis media is the most common complication and pneumonia is the most common life-threatening complication. Another late complication of measles is called SSPE which stands for subacute sclerosing panencephalitis. It is extremely rare and occurs in about 7 per million cases of measles. Finally, we come to the topic of measles vaccine. This one, it is a live attenuated freeze-dried lyophilized vaccine. I have explained the meaning of each of these words in my previous video on BCG vaccination. The link is available right here. The measles vaccine is most commonly derived from Edmondson Zagreb strain. What is the dose? The dose is 0.5 ml given subcutaneously in the anterolateral aspect of thigh. The diluent used is distilled water and not normal saline. The vaccine is to be stored at 2 to 8 degrees Celsius. The measles vaccine is remarkable since it not only gives protective efficacy of 90% but it also gives lifelong protection and all this with just one dose. But it is susceptible to light and must be stored in dark colored vials. Finally, when is the measles vaccine given? It is given exactly at 9 months age. Why? Because till 9 months the maternal antibodies protect the baby and any vaccination before that would be rendered ineffective by the natural antibodies acquired from the mother. But immunization later than 9 months means that many children will contract measles in the interval between the weaning off of the natural antibodies and the introduction of the vaccine. So, WHO expanded immunization program has recommended immunization at 9 months and India too has adopted the same. Guys, thank you for watching this video. We believe that medical education should be fun and free for everyone. If you like our videos, 
please do not forget to like share and subscribe this channel you can also see the other videos in this channel bye bye and happy learning